Guys, we're here at Locals with the Anti-Meta God. He's been playing this deck since 2006, and he never gave up, gave up on it. He's been changing it every week, and he's want, he's want to show it with us. Yeah, man, I'm going to show you all how I get down, man. Dad is SOS. Let me start it off. Thunder King is the greatest signer by Corey McDuffie. That's champ. Uh, just the best monster in the deck, man. 19 beater. Light he said monster. one for a reason. They said one for a reason, exactly. Can't add to your hand except by drawing. Grandma, I still play it as good to attack your opponent, monster, bounce it. It's good to get out of situations because it don't target, so that's really strong. I play three Kaikus. Uh, it's like one of the best cards in the deck. When it flicks damage, I can banish up two monsters from opponent's graveyard, and they can't banish from the graveyard. It's really good. It kind of slows Cosmo down. Also, monsters can't banish. I, like, I can take stuff away from the graveyard so they can't use it again. Love it. Uh, three Fossil Donnas. MVP right here. Uh, needle player can special summon when it's up face up. Straw special monster on the field. I kill them all, man, because I don't like nobody special summoning on my field. My boy, Banish of the Radiance. Any card sent to graveyard should move from play instead. I don't want nobody to have no kind of graveyard at all. No graveyard, no special summoning, no adding to your hand. None of that. I don't like that. Not in Floodgate City. Go back to my spells right here. Three card Demise. It's really good because I play a lot of back row, not a lot of monsters. So, wait, this is I can't special summon. I don't plan on doing that anyway. But, uh, draw three. Got to discard them in face one time. I just set them all anyway. Book of Moon. A lot of people don't like this card because it targets, but I like it because like a, I'll book my fossil on face down, maybe overlay into something just because. I don't know. Book of Moon's monster. It's just it's great, man. I'll play double for Vader Lance. Still good. Lance my monster. They lose a little 800 attack. Unaffected by spell and trap cards. Also good for damage set up to get over a monster that might be a little bit bigger than mine's. Double Dark Hole. Just destroy the board. A lot of times I'll, I'll chain these together. I'll Dark Hole Lance my monster. There's die. Mine doesn't die. Rageki. It's too good of a card. Uh, I'll play 3 pot Duality. Can't special summon. It's really good. Like, add add one card to my deck. Kind of speeds up because my deck's kind of slow. Um, play the Silori Calcos. It's my favorite card. One of my favorite spells. Monster gains 500 attack. Uh, you can't attack my monster with lowest attack. Take two cards to destroy it. It's really, really strong. And I play Double Mage Power. Uh, it's really good because like, my monster gains 500 attack and 500 defense. It's like, it's really strong and whatnot. So like I said, that's just like, it's 500 attack and defense is just really strong. I can put monster in defense mode, gets to get pumped up. That's my spells right there. That's a lot of spells. Yeah, it's a lot of spells. Uh, it works out really good. <clears throat> Bomber's Trap Hole, get rid of a monster. A lot of times I got Donna on board, you only got one summon. If you summon a monster one time, it's going to be over 15 to kill Donna. I just get rid of it. Ring of Destruction, it targets, but it's, it's like really fun to ring a monster. Like, it's something like a small monster and they find a combo off. I'll ring it. That's just something for the turn if I got down on the field. Macro, uh, none of that graveyard talk. Double Storming is good against Maddie Spirit. There's anything that doesn't target. A lot of cards now say they can't be targeted, so I'll just turn to the hand, put them back in the hand. I don't want no problems. Three Blades of Mirror Forces, uh, that's, that's, oh, that's my favorite. Kill your monster, and you're going to take half the damage, you're going to take it, but I don't mind taking a little monster. damage. Yeah, for each monster. I don't mind taking the damage, because I'm, I'm pretty much going to just Donna and just like beat your face in with that. Uh, double Anti-Spell Fergus. Yeah, I play a lot of spells, but like I said, I set my spells the most time. Sometimes it's bluffs, sometimes it's a set on with the card demise. Full time it's bluffs. Uh, one vein is emptiness. That's really good when I have macro or banish on the field, because something going to the graveyard, so I'll just do what I want, you won't spell something at all. And then some, some new spicy tech I added into it. Three, call it a Hunters. It's really good when I think my opponent's gonna do something crazy. They play E Telly, nah, call it a Hunter Donna. Or I think about a banish from the graveyard, call it a Hunter Kaiku. They about to try to add to the hand, road or anything. Call it a Hunter Thunder Kings. It's really good. You don't see it coming. Nobody ever sees it coming. So that's just really strong. It's really strong. I'm just testing it out now. Uh, for my cyborg, <clears throat> double cyber dragon. Because there's a lot of Cosmo players, some decks about out here, a little rogue. Anything machine, I summon it, beat over, suck them up, make them attack fortress. It's really strong. Uh, three twin twisters. I don't play any MSC's main board or anything like that. This is right. Problems like Iron Wall. Uh, any other floodgates that my opponent might play on me, Decree, anything like that, might kill Pendulum Scales, it's really strong. Uh, double Loser Turn, I was main boarding it, but with a, the, a lot of monitors out here and stuff like that, uh, not really seeing much play. Uh, I side with them now, but still good, negate effect, put them in defense mode. I play another anti-spell fragrance in the sideboard, just because I had to go against like a, a Pendulum deck, Pepe or anything like that, just shuts them down, like, you're not setting any kind of scales, you have to set them, but you can't. Another major power case is something I need to get over that's really big. I side the Moon Mirror Shoes, also for that situation, equip it to a weaker monster. It's always the strongest monster in the game right now. Uh, one more Storming, just in case, like, I have to go against something else that non-target is bound to the hand, doesn't target, Maddie Spectres. Or they can't uh, be destroyed. Can't be destroyed, yeah. 
Cosmo is good as Cosmo. I can say, I can't target him. Okay, we're just going to bounce it to your hand. Then I play, of course, three Master Strikes. No tribute for anybody. Uh, Monarchs, Magic Spirit, there's, there's no, just no tribute. Like, I don't want to see any of that happening. Uh, there goes my extra deck, which I barely use, but it's there just in case. Uh, Cowboy, it's good to just overlay burn up for 800 or maybe get over him, but I'd rather do that. Castell, bounce back a problem back to the deck. Iron Wall, Roar to create, just bounce him back. Dragon Zero. I'm playing this and I love this card because it's really, really good against uh, Morphich. Uh, they all gain attacks. So I'll just start killing them off, draw a card, and then that upkeep, they got to sack something. Dweller, good against uh, BA. Anything needs to graveyard, really. Dumb Crab King. I don't really use this one, but like it's a 3,000 meter if it need to be. If I need to get over something really bad, it's not often because like with the Donna and whatnot. Karen Gorgon, uh, it's good. Something targets, change the target to something else. One on one, kind of overlay and take a monster. Uh, I still play Rebellion, just because sometimes if I'm just trying to go for game right there. Increase your attack, increase mine, it's just one hit it. Flagship of Coin, a lot of people don't like this card, I, I love it. I love it, because like I, and this week at Locals, uh, I equipped a Black Ship of Coin with Mage Power. And like a lot of people think it's just a 21, but it's anything that's lower this attack, and I can burn you for it. And I did it uh, on an Airbus, because I had Mage Power on like three back or set. So I shipped his ass and uh, burned him for a thousand, which is all I needed, because I, I was getting close to time. That's my four stars, my three stars, a la card, kill a set card. I was thinking about playing that uh, my, uh, that uh, Quantum Phantom monster or whatever it is. But um, uh, I, this one here just kills set cards, period. And I like to somehow be they set monsters. And I don't want to, I don't want no problems. Every year, uh, it's my favorite. Bring back something that's banished. I love that banished zone. That's, I don't like no grades. I don't play that. Acid Golem, 3000 beta. Just run the face over with. Zen Mains, it's really good. I like to play this. You try to destroy it. Like a lot of times, I combo off with it. I'll summon. A, I'll, I'll book Falsadana, play Zen Mains, flip Falsadana up, kill it, get its effect, to kill some in the end phase. Then I play double Command Set Force Dragon for those machine players. If you want to play a machine? I'm gonna show you what it is. I'm gonna set the machines up, man. That's it, man. That's how I'm getting. Thanks there. for the profile. You got anything else to say? Nah, man. Uh, just uh, keep let the floodgates be open. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the profile. Macro, dude, hey, where the grave at?